Africa by Lizzo, Full Moon, Evening Stroll on the Annie Beach, 25th February 2021. I've been asked lately how I decide what device to take for the different activities I do. And for me, it all boils down to what am I trying to capture? What is my intention? And what does not hamper my mobility and my ability to enjoy the event? For me, um, a walk on the beach, I like to have my proper camera with me and the extra lens because I feel that certain things that happen along the coastline are best observed from a distance. So you are a part of it, but you're not being intrusive. You're capturing the moment without imposing yourself on it. So that's something that I found very useful for me. But if I'm trying to kind of like cover a distance on a coastline, then I would definitely have my GoPro because I just need a quicker, you know, going through covering like when I did the beach walk from Beichu to Jambiani, which was roughly, I think it was 10 or 12 kilometers. In that case, I have the GoPro and it's the main device I would use because I do want to cover that distance in a good time. But for sh short evening stroll, we're not going really far and it's more about the essence of the the beach and what's happening then I'm going to take my camera and the additional lens because I want to pick up that vibe so come along with me as I share a few moments of my evening walk along Diani Beach on this episode I will be sharing with you other experiences at the Baobab Beach Resort in um, Mombasa in case you've never been and you're thinking of where to stay I can highly recommend this place based on my experience I loved different aspects of it that you will see on other episodes Like a free as a dog having a good life here and um, he's chasing birds. See, see the other one, see the other one. This is, this is like a perfect cinema. Birds, dogs chasing birds. Go on, go for it boy, go for it boy. Yes, good boy. He's having fun, like look at them. Like living the life, chasing birds on the coast. That's, that's evenings in Mombasa. Like absolutely Diani Beach, Mombasa. There you go. I need to, I'm going to go back. Dinner. It's really dark, but I hope you can see the moon. Look at that. Is that crazy or is that crazy? Look at the moon. Let's go back up. Absolutely beautiful. Dinner is going to be soon. It's not started yet. So guys, I am early for dinner tonight. And this is my dinner plate. 
I'm trying some goat ribs and some pork and some vegetable rice, but this is so, so beautiful. And I feel good because I didn't eat lunch and this is like my reward for being so good. Another? Yes, please. Okay. Yes, please. We're getting some goat ribs, guys. Awesome. Asante. Okay, what do we have here? Pork. Huh. Maybe just a piece. <laughs> Thank you very much. So I'm beefing up meat tonight. I feel like a little pig. And here's got some assorted salads. Oh, beetroot. I see beetroot. So I'm going to wait for just that beetroot. Asante. Are the, are the broccoli cooked or what are they? Cooked. Can I just have one or two? Let's go. One more. Thank you. We got that. What's in here? A bit more beetroot. Uh, nope. Okay, so let's find out what's in the other corners. Something interesting. Mambo. Seafood. What is that? Okay, let me have a bit of that on the side. A little bit of a weird plate, but we'll do it. That's okay, thank you. Um, and what you've got here? Yeah. Nan bread. Hi, can I see what you have inside the... Oh, nan, and what's in that one? There's some barilla and probably my chicken. And this one? And that's my salad. Oh, those ones, okay. So welcome to our room in Baobab Resort. It's a twin I'm sharing with Kanye. And um, I just want to show you around a bit. We've got, of course, a sitting area. We'll come back to that later. Let's show you the bathroom. Voila. I made my sleeping outfit already. I'm so tired. Shower. It's a scarier again. And the room. Isn't it lovely? <sighs> I do hope you've enjoyed this episode. Thank you very much for watching. Yours truly, Liesl81.